Hey guys, so I just had my um, third, I think third ever Zoom meeting ever from a cold call and uh, this is the closest I've gone to a sale. I'm not going to disclose how much we're selling the website for. I'm not going to disclose these obviously for privacy reasons, but I'll say that it's the website deal is somewhere between a thousand and three thousand dollar website. So I'm not going to say exact how much is somewhere. The website deal that we're um, working on is somewhere between a thousand USD to three thousand dollar USD. So it's like it's not a huge website. It's like a me medium website, and we're doing some uh, we're producing content writing and stuff like that. So uh, we're we're in the works, but um, you know I wanted to show you guys that I am making progress. I'm not just doing cold calls. I'm also doing Zoom meetings. Unfortunately, I'm not going to um, this uh, reveal the do the full recordings because there's privacy concerns and it's business. This is a live business deal. Um, I don't want to lose the deal, obviously, and. Uh, but I do want to just show you like a one minute clip of the two hour of the one and a half hour segment just to show you the guys that the presentation was actually real and I actually did something. Um, and uh, um, instead of talking about the Zoom meeting or the sales presentation, I want to just talk briefly, like just talk monologue a little bit about what led up to it, what I'm doing things, how I'm updating, my, how I'm uh, practicing my rapport building skills, how I'm improving in sales, how I'm learning more about websites, uh, digital marketing, so I can actually have more product knowledge. And uh, you know, like I, I want to instead of just doing quote, like I've been focused on booking appointments, which is good. <coughs> but I also want to like learn more product knowledge and get actually actually be part of the web presentation. Like so far, I've relied on um, business partners or agency owners or runners who already have a team because I don't want to. I want to. I really. I, I'm really passionate about the sales aspect of things and customer service and project management, and team building. But I hate doing technical stuff like Facebook ads, Google search engine optimization, content writing, keyword research, um, what else? Like building, signing a con uh, writing out a contract and all the technical terms, having employee contracts and stuff like all these technical things I want to delegate to someone else doing um, because I really like my passion in life is, is socializing. That's my passion. And I, I want to, you know, like down the line, I'll learn more. I, I do like, I do watch like hour long videos of like um, Facebook ads, digital marketing, wholesale. I watch a lot of videos on uh, real estate just to get an idea. You know, it's like, this is a constant learning process. Cause obviously I do have to have product knowledge. Like I do have to um, talk about real things, but my main focus is like uh, doing social skills, like project management, team building, um, having employees or, or like people that I supervise and like motivate um, or um, like these kind of things interest me like customer service, project management, sales, <coughs> sales presentations, like communication. I really, really love communication. So like once I have communication down, yes, then I'll learn the technical stuff and focus on that like all, all in. But I just don't see that happening because like there's so much you can learn about socializing, social skills that it's like it's almost like a never ending process. Like it's like saying, it's like saying, can you become a better actor? Yeah, of course. There's so many skill sets that you can learn to be a, a actor like Robert Downey Jr. or Crim Samsworth or um, or uh, I can't think of any or or um, you, you know, you just want to be like a good actor, like you know, like like Rock Dwayne Johnson, like wh whoever want to be, like want to be like social skill is such a pe people often assume that social skills are something that you're born with. But I'm of the belief that it's something that can be learned, and mastered from zero to 100%. Like I, I strongly believe that <laughs> if someone is um is horrible at sales, but they want to improve, they can become an expert pro salesperson within a matter of maybe half a year, half a year to oh, maybe not half a year, maybe 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 a full year, maybe a full year, as long as there's motivation and drive. So um yeah, so like there's so many things you can learn like um. Like something that I do is some a habit that I picked up is whenever I go outside, um, whether I'm like just getting coffee or I'm at some hospital appointments because I had some uh, I have to see the doctor, or uh, if I'm going to the supermarket or um, I'm going to the gym or where else, uh, or if I'm if I'm even if even if I'm playing a video game, um, and there's voice chat. Actually, I scratched that. Video games aren't really like conducive unless you're playing with your friends and you're talking about more deeper stuff. But like, whenever you can have a constructive conversation, just find an excuse to talk to people. Find like figure out how to have a constructive conversation, and not just do that, but figure out how to have an even more constructive conversation than your last constructive conversation with whoever you had a constructive conversation with. Like, just just focus on that. Like, you can do it. Like, like improv skills, acting skills, communication skills, public speaking skills. These are all skills that. Um, that you can really, really master 
it, it it takes like you have to focus on communication as an art form and as a science like you have to go approach like you have to see communicate like I, I know this is going to turn people off but you know like because you know like sometimes you want to relax and just like have people who around, be around people who love you for who you are and accept you for who you are yes that's good but um if you really want to like for, but, but let's say that that you want to be the prime minister of canada you know um, i'm not too much into politics but let's say that or you want to be like a judge or a high district district level judge or something you can't just say i'm gonna leave my communication skills up to whatever like I, I, up to rap up to freelance freestyle like i or um you can't just leave it up to chance you actually have to focus on um yeah <coughs> you actually have to focus on communication skills like like actors and voice actors constantly practice their communication skills it's, actors don't just they're not born actors even child actors they actually are conditioned from a very early age to practice very specific social and communication skills and by the time they are a child actor at the age of eight or ten they already have like five years of parents constantly conditioning them to practice certain social skill sets it's not like for example take take uh take crying on command tearing up on command that's a that's a practice skill that's an emotional skill set that you have to practice i could learn how to do that if i wanted to although i i have no intention of because you know I'm, I'm more interested in business than in acting but um same one i'm just taking like a like a very technical example of emotional skill but like communication skill <coughs> public speaking skill it's all like communication so you know in sales it's like rapport building skills is very important just like you can learn how to code you can learn how to communicate and um, yeah that was my main message um i'm starting to reap the benefits of or i'm starting to see more like more <coughs> i'm getting closer to my first close um and i really want to make my commission too because obviously i haven't been making much of that that much money recently but um i'm working on it i really want to succeed in this i'm putting the hours i'm putting the work uh, and uh, yeah, I just wanted to, and, and I'll include the clip of me in the Zoom presentation just as proof that I actually got to a high, like um, closer to the, we didn't close yet, obviously, but we're getting there. And, you know, th these kind of things gives me confidence that I, whatever I'm doing is working, I'm getting closer to it. Obviously, if I made this, I'd be much more confident and happier, but, you know, well, hopefully it comes. And uh, right now, I just want to focus on booking more meetings because, um, so I have to focus more on cold calling and I'll have to do that. Like, I have to dial at least 100 numbers a day. Um, I think I only dialed like 50, 40 or 50 today. I saw somewhere there. I think I dialed like, I think I dialed 40, I think. Um, so I have to increase that up to like 100 a day. Um, uh, yeah, so I hope guys, I got something useful out of this. Join my Discord. I'm growing my Discord. I really want it to grow it as fast as possible. Um, in the future, I might ask someone to... I might get a mod. I don't know. I, 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 it only has 50 members right now, but once it reaches like 200, 300 members, I might start looking for a mod moderator for it as well. Um, and I'm, I'm experimenting, <coughs> experimenting with it as well. But um, yeah, this is my business journey. I'm documenting it. I hope you guys enjoy this video. Enjoy the clip of the Zoom meeting and uh, or the Google Meet meeting, whatever. Um, I hope you guys enjoy this video and I'll see you guys in my next one. I'll try to upload more cold calling videos tomorrow. Thanks so much. Signing out. And 3.9 million total impressions. Impressions are are just them like uh, people like looking at it and then like pass, passing it through. So it it, it involves a, <coughs> it does involve into like the uh, the, the total clicks. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So so going on uh, from there. Um, yeah, so sorry, interrupting you. It's just uh, these statistics are based off uh, search engine optimization for them. Yes. Yes. So. Um, uh, so this is uh, this basically tracks the customer behavior. Um, mm -hmm. I, I know this stuff is probably confusing, but we have um, we have like a 